Hey, that's me. Wait, I, I don't remember this. I'm Saad, a typical Stony Brook pre-med student. When I'm not studying for classes diligently all night, every night, or shooting hoops at the rec center with the guys, banking threes all day, every day, you can find me at the MSA. This is Seawolf Country. You're probably wondering, what's an MSA and where can I get me one of those? Well, here, you can unwind and relax with your friends, sit down, grab a bite, talk a little bit, or be at peace in the solitude of room 248, the prayer room, one of the more quiet places on campus. Except that one time we were being really loud, and Sister Sana told us to be quiet or she'll kick our butts. There's Sister Sana now at our weekly general body meeting. She's the chaplain at Stonebrook University, but she's also more like a mentor and guide to us all. A mother figure, so to speak. She's responsible for the halal food and the prayer room on campus. And the prayer room does sometimes feel a little bit tight with all those people, but the morals and values it capacitates makes it ultimately priceless. Just as soon as you think you've had enough of this place, there's Juma in the ballroom. You get to listen to an amazing sermon and say goodbye to friends for the week as you take the train or car home. But the MSA doesn't stop happening at Juma. These are just some of the faces you see here on a daily basis. My name is Saad, welcome to the Stony Brook MSA.